Sean Jansen, welcome to Connacht Rugby. You're only here a few weeks, but how are you finding life at Connacht Rugby so far? Nah, loving it so far. Um, boys are good, coaches are good. Um, it's a cool city. I've been in a town a few times, very busy city, and um, yeah, everyone's been real helpful with the transition moving over here, so yeah, loving it. What are you most excited about now that you've moved to Connacht Rugby? Um, probably playing in the URC first of all, uh, get to do a bit of travelling and stuff, never been over here. Um, playing in front of seeing the crowd, playing in front of the crowd, something to be excited about, you know, getting involved in the team. And um, yeah, yeah, that's about it. So, so. Were you ever over in Ireland before you came here actually? I've been over once, oh, once or twice of uh, travelling, but that's something as well I'm a bit excited about because my grandparents were born here, so you know, get to um, see some cousins that I've um, that I've never met before and some that I have, so get to explore that side of my family as well. Talk to us about where you come from in New Zealand, Sean. I'm from um, down south, it's called Dunedin, um, uni town, it's the town of the Highlanders, if, if you know where that is in rugby, so yeah, it's a cool wee place, it's home, you know, where my family and all my um, close friends are, so yeah. Making that move actually from New Zealand to when you moved to Leicester in England, how did you find that move at the start, like leaving home, leaving your family and all your friends? Um, it's tough, definitely, and definitely it's highs and lows. Um, being away from, you know, moving over by yourself, not knowing anyone, and I'm um, quite a family friend, like family and friends are quite tight, so it was very tough at times, but, um, you know, like I'm out there doing it for them as well, so that kind of outweighs everything that goes on, so yeah, and I loved it though. You're a back rower, a big man, but coming up through the ranks, was there any other positions that you played when you were younger? Oh, so I didn't start playing rugby till when I was 13, and I started off as a second five, so um, just those one, two hit ups, one, two crashes, and then um, yeah, eventually, I guess, got uh, knocked down to the forwards, but yeah. Talk is true, Sean. You have a bit of a unique hairstyle going on there. We've, we've a lot of unique hairstyles in Connacht rugby, but yours is definitely going to stand out. Talk us through this hairstyle you have going on. Uh, it's called a horse tail, so um, yeah, it gets like a tail at the back. It's quite um, a common hairstyle in New Zealand. Like uh, I think like 90% of my mates all have one or a couple flinging out. So um, I've been growing it for quite long, so it's pretty long. I used to have a big mullet, now it's been all the way down my back, but it's something from home, so it's something I got from home while being over here, I guess. And no comments from any of your teammates about it? Anyone saying... What's going um, on there? No, not too much. I, I had a lot of chat at, uh, when I was in England, but I think the boys are too uh, polite so far. I guess I'll slowly get some more chat as I, as I go through. Finally, just a message to the fans, Sean, in terms of your first season here and what you're hoping for and in terms of playing out there at the sports ground. I'm just really excited to get involved. Um, I've, seen, I've seen a couple of games on television and it looks like a real passionate place to play. So uh, really excited to hopefully get in there, um, wear that jersey and do all proud.